They were in high school when they met And things got kinda awkward Hello guys, welcome back to my channel In today's video, we are going to be doing a laundry room makeover Look, before you say anything, I am personally ashamed of my laundry room okay so you cannot shame the shameless i am ashamed already for you guys <laughs> on behalf of you guys so today's video i am going to be you know starting a makeover here because this is like the tiniest room in the house no it's not the tiniest room but it is almost it is one of the tiniest rooms we have in the house so it is so messy so disorganized it has become a dumping ground and it's time to give it a thorough transformation so lovelies before we proceed kindly hit the like button please you guys should help me hit the like button so that youtube will know that you guys are enjoying my videos and push it for others to see and also subscribe to my channel if this is the first time you are seeing this face because we have loads and loads of videos like this on this channel anyway so the first thing i'm doing here is just to declutter all this stuff man all this stuff in fact i don't even know so many things here that are not supposed to be here the boys are helping me move them down to the garage okay so we cleared up this particular cupboard and i still have some things left here so these ones are things that i'm definitely going to be leaving here for now okay so the next thing is to take off this thing this thing i don't even know what it is guys it was in the midst of trying to get something to keep this wall busy i got this thing hanged here and i thought i could use it to you know hang maybe single socks or you know whatever but it's not useful so i'm taking it off okay so yeah and then once i'm done with that i'm gonna go ahead to fill up the wall the whole I have a, a white wood filler so that's not going to be a problem so as soon as i fill it up we get straight into work so the plan for this place is i want to you know wallpaper the wall i i've got two rolls of wallpaper already at home so that's not going to cost me anything at all because i have basically almost everything at home so i'm going to go ahead to wallpaper the wall guys i have not wallpapered before alone the other one I did was with my brother-in-law. So this is the, what do you call it? Wallpaper adhesive. And that's, yeah, I got this from the range. So that's what I'm going to be using. I'm going to be mixing it up. You guys, if you ever want to wallpaper, don't worry. The direction is just at the back of the whole thing. So yeah, this is it. I have mixed up my adhesive. So I'll just go ahead to start wallpapering the wall. <music> Okay guys, so we finally finished with wallpapering this wall. It was a struggle because of all the corners, lots of cuttings and you know, joinings and all that. But finally, I was able to pull it off. The only difference you're going to see is just the texture. So it has, it's a textured wallpaper and it has some glitters on it. You guys know by now I do not like colors on my wall. So yeah, this is good because the space is small. So I decided to use a bright color to just make it look bigger than what it actually is. So the next thing now is to go ahead and buy um, storage containers. I don't have good ones here. So I'll make time to go. That will be some other day. For now, I'm tired. So I'll see you guys later. We came to get some storage containers for the utility room. Yeah. So, yeah, let me just see if I can get some storage containers for that utility because 
I think it's time I just go ahead out of the night ever since I finished the wallpaper. So I'll catch you guys inside. Your face in the crowd. I never thought that I would see you tonight. With lock eyes and you smile. Every single memory comes back to life. Your lips pressed against mine after a night out. We got drunk and ended up at your place. From the moment that I saw you, I knew that it was the bet that you felt the same. guys so right now i have grouped all these cleaning products honestly i didn't realize how much cleaning products i had until i started this so i have grouped all of them so here i have um all my sprays the toilet cleaners the kitchen cleaners the laundry um bean bags and yeah these are for the carpets and all that so i'm going to try and see how i can organize them into this but the challenge I'm having right now is that the height of these shelves are not so high. So I have to, I don't know, I have to play around between here and here to make sure everything fits in. So yeah, let's get into organization. I love it. Anyways, I got these bottles from a lady on Instagram, um, personalized lady. Um, you guys, this is where I buy most of my personalized bottles anyway, so you're gonna see it in the description box So yeah, I got this for our laundry um, Our laundry liquid, so yeah, let's get into the business So the next thing guys i'm going to go ahead to hang a frame here so i'm just gonna drill the wall right now this is a base i bought from dunem and i resprayed it to white because it, it was gold i mean i didn't know i was gonna use it here but that Anyways, I, I sprayed it to white, so I'm going to use this um, just to add a little decoration to this area. I have this, whatever plant this is from the range. I've had it in the house for a long time, so I'm just going to get this just to add a little life in here. So, this is going to be here. blank like the top of this cupboard so i got this from ikea some time ago and it's a line fallow in the house so and then i've not used it because of the black. 
Oh my god, Kara, Kara stop making noise. I've not used it because of the black base. So I also oh um, so, so, so to switch it up to my taste, I got this from Janine. This was this went for just four pounds. This is like an empty flower pot, so I just drop it in here and here we go. Voila. So it doesn't affect the opening and closing of this though. So I decided to get this so that it will come in handy whenever we need to wash. I mean, I don't have to be scattering everything. So I just use this directly into our washing um, machine. So I have probably placed this here. So I'm going to use this tray, guys, to operate this corner here. And I'll place this here. This is a mushroom that I got from B&M yesterday. So I'll just place it right here, just to add a little bit of, you know, glitter. And place my little candle right here. And then to finish it off, I got this candle from B&M as well. Oh my God, it smells so nice. This is, um, it says it's white jasmine. Guys, it's so lovely. But another thing that really attracted me to it was just a stand and I was like, yay, my laundry room. So this is going to go right here. Just perfect fit for this corner. Okay guys, so in summary, I didn't spend up to 90 pounds to give this laundry room a transformation that it deserves. So you can actually look around your house to know what you have and then possibly just convert it to anything just to keep it organized. So yeah, this is it. I mean, it looks really decluttered, well organized, and I don't see this place getting, you know, disorganized anytime soon because everything now has a home in here please if you have not liked this video kindly go ahead to hit the like button it is free of charge okay hit the like button and subscribe if you are new to this channel and yeah i hope this video has inspired somebody and share to a friend who needs this type of inspiration we all need this type of inspiration once in a while because it takes a whole lot of, you know, energy and stamina to just get up and say, okay, let me push out those things from the cupboard and get organizing and get decorating. So yeah, if I could do it, you too can do it. So get up and start organizing. <laughs> before we end this video, I'm going to show you guys the before and the after. So stay tuned and I'll see you in my next one. Stay fabulous. Bye. Think about me one more time before you go. Someday you'll know. Someday you'll know. And you know what I'm going to say. I've been feeling this way for far too long.